afternoon, Metallurgical High Vacuum. We're the best kept secret in, in the pump rebuilding business. Certain people are finding out. I mean, we have, we do a lot of work with, with a company in Rhode Island, and uh, I mean, they can ship these things anywhere they want to do it, and uh, we, we've been getting a lot of their business, so we're doing something right. Well, Metallurgical High Vacuum is a small company um, by industry standards, so we're able to focus a lot closer to what our customer needs uh, instead of offering a range of products and expecting them to take what we have, we can custom uh, design and custom build their equipment to fit their needs instead of ours. The first thing that happens when a piece of equipment comes in is it's logged in, uh, all the numbers are recorded, the serial numbers, etc. cetera. Uh, any known problems are, are recorded. The pump then goes to disassembly, where it's disassembled by highly trained technicians that really know what they're looking for when they take a pump apart. All the components are examined, they're measured, anything that's out of tolerance or shows any kind of wear is noted. From there, all the parts that are reused go into a, a hot caustic wash. A lot of pieces of equipment come in with five or six coats of paint on them because everybody tries to keep their plant looking good. That paint is the best insulator there is. Let's get rid of uh, five or six coats of paint here and uh, start out with a product that's essentially like a new. So we're dealing with nice clean castings. <clears throat> Most of them look like the day they, they came out of the foundry. All that effluent, all the rinse water and so forth is captured because we can't get rid of that. So that all has to be pumped into a special holding tank and then we have that carted away as hazardous waste. So we generate no waste here that goes down the drain. It all has, it's all taken away. The components then go to the machining process where any machining that's required will be performed. They go to reassembly, where they're reassembled using, in most cases, a premium product, premium gaskets, premium sealers, a lot of new parts. After a piece of equipment is assembled, it goes to our test lab where everything is run for approximately 24 hours. We helium leak test everything that, that goes through here so that uh, the customer gets something that's going to have acceptable base pressure. From there it goes to our paint shop where we have a, a very environmentally friendly paint process. They're painted again to look like new, perform like new. They then get crated uh, where once again we probably spend a little extra but uh, we sure don't want to see that piece of equipment damaged by a freight line before it even gets back to the customer. Now we also rebuild diffusion pumps. We have capabilities to weld the cooling tubes on just like Varian does originally with a silicon bronze filler, which again is something most rebuilders don't do. They would normally scrap the pump. So we have capability there with our machining to make those new boiler plates, put all the studs in and blend your drain and get them, get everything right. That's absolute value because when you, when you can uh, uh, remanufacture that diffusion pump for 40 or 50 percent of the replacement cost, you're way ahead. We have a huge inventory. Uh, the accountants complain about our inventory level all the time, but we can provide a much faster turnaround for our customer by having the parts in inventory. One of the concepts that our Parts Express division has been using that has turned out to be very popular is packaging all the parts that are required to do service on a particular piece of equipment. 
and we find that that makes it so simple for the, the maintenance people down line to have all those parts handy so they've got all the gaskets, the springs, all the parts they're going to need. They don't have to inventory the individual parts, just the car. I think you'll find in our manufacturing facility we've got one of the most highly educated uh, group of people you could ask for. Quite a few of the technicians are college educated. We, we make a real effort to have the highest skilled workforce that we can get. We take good care of them and that leads to a very low turnover rate. At Metallurgical High Vacuum, we work very hard every day to maintain the highest level of quality, the highest level of expertise in our industry. We have the people, we have the equipment to perform at a level that hopefully exceeds our customers' highest expectations. Do you want to spend $7,500 on a rebuild every 10 to 11 months? Or do you want to spend the 12000 on the rebuild and do it every two and a half to three years? I mean, that's, it, it's really, it, it's that simple.